Ukraine's emergency services released these heartbreaking scenes of the devastation at the shopping center in the central Ukrainian city of Kremenchuk after it was hit in a Russian missile strike. The Russian missile strike, which has made headlines around the world, has been described by Ukraine's President Volodymyr Zelensky as one of the most brazen terrorist acts in European history. Over 1,000 people are said to have been inside the building when it was hit by missiles. Nearly 20 dead had been reported at the time of writing, with the number expected to climb as rescuers search through debris. Russia invaded Ukraine on February 24th. In what the Kremlin is calling a special military operation today marks the 25th day of the invasion. At this 40 missile city, Ukrainian capital Kiev G7 leaders met in Bavaria. In Germany, at the beginning of the three-day summit, military support for Ukraine is at the top of the agenda. G7 is made up Germany, France, Italy, Japan, Canada, the United Kingdom and the United States. G7 leaders described the shopping mall missile strike as abominable. NATO is planning to boost its quick reaction forces from 40,000 troops to over 300,000 troops. World leaders are set to approve plans to increase the number of NATO troops on high alert at a summit in Madrid. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan is meeting Finland's Sauli Ninisto and Magdalena Andersson of Sweden at the NATO summit in Madrid to try to resolve their issues. Russian missiles have also hit the center city of Cherkasy as well as the strategic vital port of Odessa. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky addressed the G7 leaders and said that he wanted the war to end before the end of the year. He repeated his request for anti-aircraft defense systems as well as further sanctions on Russia. He also repeated his request for help to export grain Ukraine.